Yo, what's going on, people of the internet? It's Keanu bringing back another Destiny video. And just bear with me here. I may not know what to say simply because I haven't done a gameplay commentary that isn't live yet on my channel. Like, something like this. But, like, the no content and the... What else was it? I can't remember what else there was. But the no content video, that was easy because I only had one topic. And that was about life wise but talking about a gun doing this is going to be so much more difficult and yes i know it's difficult but i like to say difficult okay some people get it i swear if people don't stop this crap you know what you know what i'm turning off my phone like legit legit no it's not happening anyways today we will be taking a look at the exotic auto rifle Kvostov. Before the Rise of Iron expansion, this was a white gun you first got in Destiny. Everyone got this gun, no matter how hard you want to deny it, everyone got this gun, okay? Because I know some people were like, Oh, my first gun in Destiny was the blue hand cannon. I can't remember what... I can't remember what it's called, but it was just a blue hand cannon, they say it. And I'm like, no, it's the Kvostov. But some people are just retarded, and you can't help but just accept their retardedness, even though that's not a word, I don't think. No, it's not. But anyways, this is called the Kvostov, and we all know its perks and attachments because it was leaked out a couple of weeks before Rise of Iron actually came out. In this video, you will be seeing me go through all the different perks on it. So, for example, you will see me doing auto rifle with 450 RPM, I believe it's called, and 900 RPM. And then also the scout rifle with, I believe I was using 900 RPM for that. And for the pulse rifle, I was using 450 or 900 as well. So, in my opinion, this is an excellent auto rifle if you get to know how it works and everything. Well, I mean, it's a gun, so all you have to do is just, like, shoot and everything. But, like, you get where I'm trying to go with this, okay? As long as you get its handling done and its recoil, everything will be A-OK -okay for you. But I really do enjoy this weapon. It's a fun weapon to use. I would advise you to try and go for this weapon. But anyways, hopefully you guys do enjoy this video. A like, comment will be amazing. And this has been really weird since I have never done something like this. And never really talked about a gun like this before. So just bear with me. Okay, now let me shut up so at least you guys get into the gameplay here. So hopefully you guys do enjoy this video. A like, comment will be amazing. And I'll see you guys in the video. Peace. If you wanna find another place, love, disappear and never leave a trace. Take you where you where you want. So let me decide. <clears throat> now I'm gonna get my voice. And you will on your heart. Let me decide. I just wanna know who you really are. <clears throat> I, I don't know why I can't do this. Oh my god, for freak's sake, I don't even press the recording button half of the time and it just starts recording for no apparent reason. Like what the hell, Bungo fix the Elgato, will you? But, um, yo, what's going on people of the internet? It's Keanu bringing back another Destiny video. As always, it's about time I actually made a real Destiny video that actually, like, does a weapon review. Because, you know, I finished the story. The story wasn't the best looking in views, but I don't really care about views, to be honest. I just like to upload what I like to do. Game thing. 
whatever you want to call it. But today we are looking at the exotic Kvastov 7G-0X or would it be 0X? Whichever one you want to say. An ancient instrument of war renewed and enhanced by light, not unlike you. Anyways, today we are going to be rocking with the classic scope. Um, and all the, well, I'm going to be switching between these. I'll do three games, one automatic, one burst, mm -hmm. one semi-auto. Hammer forge, rifle barrel, or brace frame. I went for brace frame simply because, like, you know, stability-wise, it's just better in my opinion. Oh, the case study. Uh, oh, oh, that's what it was. And moving on, extended mag, counterbalance, and range finder. And I'm going to be switching between these two as well. For automatic, I think 450 mm -hmm. RPM is probably better in my opinion. But I'm going to use 900 RPM. And look at this longbow that I got. I opened up a package yesterday. And I got this. I mean, yeah, you can't hit supers. Wait, people are the supers no more. But like, still, look at that row. Long view, last resort, snapshot, unflinching. Like, that's perfect. I mean, I used this a game ago. I'm not going to lie. But that was just with everything not operated. Like, as soon as you get it, that's how I played the Crucible game. Didn't have no upgrades to it or whatnot. Holy mother of pro, I can't do this. No, this is too much. That RPM rate per fire, I think that's what it's called. Something like that. Like, this, this thing, oh jeez, I can't do this. Like, that thing was too fast. Did you see how fast that thing shot? Bro, this thing shoots so fast and I can't control it. Like, I literally can't control it. Like, I'm trying my best to, but it's not working out. <laughs> like, I... A lot of people say that I'm good, but then in reality, it's just like, go to Xbox One and that will show you all the proof right there. Here we go! Bro, you're not safe in there. I don't know what you was trying. Okay, that actually worked out perfectly. Fine. <laughs> oh, okay. And you know what? Should, should I do this? Should I do this? I'm doing it. Come here. <laughs> yes. Oh, that was gonna be my kill. No, that's not even fair, dude. Oh yeah, that that definitely yeah definitely makes a difference. That guy's over there using these Soros Disc Forty Seven. This guy's just over here sticking people just for the hell of it. <laughs> Okay, guys, I'm sorry, but I can't do this, okay? Like, this, this, this scout rifle crap is not for me. I'm sorry. But don't, I'm not, never going to touch the scout rifle perk on this gun. Never gonna happen. Uh, no, what? Are you serious? This guy is still going? I got him. T Rex arms.
What? What? <laughs> How does that even work? All I will probably say to you guys, if you're like me that just sucks at the game, just stick to auto rifle with this weapon. Just, just do that. Everything's gonna be okay. I hope this idiot nerds <laughs> that is not using armor of light. <laughs> Because every other post rifle will outbeat it any day of the week. No, what? I could have went off. No. Did he really just do that? He punched me out of my super just like that. No Fs given. Like, I swear you have to only hit headshots with this weapon. Nothing more, nothing less. I said this countless times throughout this video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this gameplay slash commentary. Zing ma bubby. But, as you can see, we got 20 kills and don't get... Oh, I was just about to say, we don't get rewarded, but we actually did it for once. Persistence and take a knee, not the best on... A LMG but I'll take it we ended off with a 2.22 KD versus the 3.33 now it's 2.22 what next 1.11 but anyways hopefully you guys did enjoy this video a like comment will be amazing and I will see you guys in the crucible and when I see you guys when I see you guys peace Face. Look me in the face, tell me that you love me, even if it's